you something new at the great New York State Fair, but this can also be a time to catch up with old friends. Sure is. News Channel 9's Casey Hornerbaum caught up with a central New York figure from the past whose name lives on here at the fair. Well, there's never a shortage of food at the State Fair, but how are local vendors faring after the challenges of this past year? We've been here since 1939. For David Pizio, coming out to the New York State Fair is not only a yearly tradition, it's a family one, and one that he looks forward to every year. I've been here 50 years myself. Uh, my father started in 39, 1939, out here in the same location. But with everything local businesses have been through over the past few years, from surviving the pandemic to dealing with now inflation and shortages, setting up for the fair has brought challenges along with it. Pricing, uh, labor, uh, trying to find a labor people that want to work and show up. That's, that's most of the battle. Yeah, we finally got enough staff in and found products that we needed. Uh, it's every day you call, they're out of this and they can't, they don't have that. Or, but we're making do. And although there have been some changes since the times of 50 cent meatball and sausage sandwiches, Pizio says. No radical changes of anything really. Uh, pretty much everything's getting back in stock. And regardless of what goes on behind the counter, it's who's on the other side that means the most to him and keeps him coming back every year. Mostly the people. Seeing people you only see once a year and they stop by and old customers from our other restaurants. People enjoying it, being happy, enjoying the fair, the music, the entertainment. I only do this one. At the fairgrounds, Casey Honick. Mm, now I'm hungry. Me too. <laughs> Pizio's, such a family affair. And they're not the only ones. We also have Basilio sausage, we have pillage uh, pizza free, and we also have Bosco's at the fair. Oh, those prime rib sandwiches at Bosco's. All <laughs> great selections. The Villa Pizza Free. I've been doing that for years. <laughs> That's a tradition for, for our family. We gotta take a break. We'll be back right after this.